The microcontroller is RP2040. So in this video, I'm going to show you my new Raspberry Pi Pico board. And as you see in this box, I bought it from Cytron Technologies. This company is from Malaysia. So let's see how it looks inside. So what you have is the actual Pico board. So this Pico board is already pre-soldered pins. As you see here, the pins are already soldered. So this is one of the versions that Cytron sell. And then they have this cable that's so thick. It's a very strong cable. And then also they have a they provided a guide about the pinouts. So this is handy because as you see here in the Pico, there is actually no silk screen on top. The silk screen is at the bottom. So when you put it on your breadboard, you're actually blinded on what are the pin names of these pins. So this Pico is actually a microcontroller board. It's not a micro I mean, it's not a microprocessor or it cannot load any Linux operating system in here. So it's kind of different from our traditional Raspberry Pi boards. So to compare it in terms of size, you see here a Raspberry Pi 4, 8 gig, and the Pico, the Raspberry Pi Pico. You see that's not, you know, you see it's, it's really small. So you can program this Pico via MicroPython, C, and C++. And there are lots of board that is also based on this microcontroller. The microcontroller is RP2040. So this is the first microcontroller released by the Raspberry Pi team itself. I'm going to release more videos about this. This is just the unboxing of my new Pico board. I'm so excited to have this. And I hope you will watch those videos that I will upload. Thank you guys. Bye-bye.